This family is upset, and rightfully so. Not only did these animals cost over $5,000, but they say it's taken an emotional toll on them as well. This guy right here, his full name is Hubble's Loaded Weapon. We just call him Loader. Ranching is a way of life for this Mayfield family. It's an everyday thing. There's no day off. Come here, Loader. Come here, big guy. It's a labor of love. It's a big commitment to have these kind of animals. But the Meekums love doing it. You like having your horns scratched, too. Such trusting and gentle creatures, too. And people think they're scary because of their big horns, but this guy's just a big puppy dog. They never had a reason to worry about the animals they care for. And up there you can see our other bull and a couple of cows. Until last Wednesday. It's just senseless. It makes you fear that it's going to happen again. They were celebrating new life. We had a little baby girl, Oakley. But when they came back from the hospital... When we returned home from this happy occasion, we had uh, something not quite so happy to deal with. They saw this. It's scary and it it's unnerving. One of their gentle giants, a Texas longhorn bull. She had a really beautiful, a beautiful head, set of horns. Shot and killed. And it was hard to see and uh, to see him in that position and then to know that he didn't just die he actually did suffer alongside a black angus steer calf it is really sad you become attached to him this is the enclosure that the bull and the little steer were in the senseless act now setting them back thousands and then some there's the monetary thing there's the emotional part there's um Psychological. Leaving them hoping whoever did this will be found. Taking a treat. There he goes. This isn't a victimless crime. It's not just a cow. That There are consequences to it. Another one. The Meekums are offering a $2,500 reward for anyone who has information that can lead to this person being found. They say they hope it doesn't happen to anyone else. Live in studio, L. Thomas, Fox 13 News, Utah.